Welcome back to the channel guys, it's your boy Smokester here, back at you with another video and today we are on Stone Point Round 1 by Buzz Cooksey. Now, I gotta be honest man, I wish that we had more of the reflex tracks in MX bikes man, they're just so good, you know what I'm saying? So, the fact that we got this one is pretty awesome man, and he did a phenomenal job on it. The only thing that I could say about the track at all that isn't positive is that I wish it was a little bit more rough. You know what I'm saying? It's very smooth, very flat. Um, but as far as replicating what was in MX vs. ATV Reflex, he did a phenomenal job, bro. So I actually went and played this track on Reflex, and I'm going to put the side-by-side -side of this vs. the Reflex track here in a little bit. That way we can, you know, that way y'all can see like how close it resembles it. And he did a phenomenal job replicating it, man. He really did. I just wish it was a little bit more rough, but like that's not even a big deal. Most people would prefer it to be like this anyway. So, and to be honest with you, it's crazy. I had a harder time doing the laps on Reflex than I did on this. Obviously I play this game a lot more and I haven't played Reflex in years. Um, but it was on sale. I want to say it was like two weeks ago, maybe on Steam for like three bucks. And so I had bought it then and uh, it actually came out to be useful. So pretty fire, pretty fire. But yeah, Buzz Cooksey. I always mispronounce his name in stream. Buzz Cooksey has done a phenomenal job on this. So Buzz, if you're watching this, man, I want to see more reflex tracks, bro. And if you could add a little bit more roughness to them that's all that's it and that would be fire bro that would be fire now um i don't know i guess i forgot how good the track deformation was in reflex so when i was playing the uh i did two races on this track on there just to kind of get a decent lap <laughs> and the terrain deformation on that track or on that game is actually pretty crazy um I, f I forgot how good it was, man. Like I said, I haven't played that game in years, but me and Nazwad were talking about it yesterday, and it's crazy that they lost the files to that, bro. Because had they not lost the files to that game, I feel like they would have had such a good basis for like every MX game, MX versus ATV game that came out after that. And being that they lost those files, they really kind of went downhill after that i gotta say like alive was really good but like i just feel like they could have been so much better had they not lost those files you know what i'm saying but man dude you did a phenomenal job on this track bro and i want to say this is one of the stadiums that uh just got released as like a what is it like a template stadium uh i forget who released them but it was the same one that was used in like Mouse Moto Park. Well, different stadium because there was multiple of them. But it resembles the stadium so well of the uh, one that was in Reflex. I could be wrong about that too. Let me know down below. Is this like, did he custom make this stadium to go with the track? I think it was one of those template stadiums. I could be wrong though. Now I got me. Now I'm second guessing myself. I'm not sure, brother. But yeah phenomenal job man and like i said i'd love to see more reflex tracks and mx bikes it's uh definitely nostalgic man it really is so i will put the when we cross the finish line right here i will put the side by side of the lap um that we ran on reflex on here and we ran it on the on the ricky carmichael bike so we had to stay true to the suzuki you know what i'm saying we running it on here so definitely I'm, it's just nostalgic man now I haven't been able to race on this yet and um, I'm definitely going to when I see a server up with a good amount of people in it but I was curious so I've, I've been putting quite a few 1v1s up on the channel let me know down below what you guys think of those do you do you, are you do you like them a lot could you do without them like give me some honest feedback man I ain't, I ain't gonna be mad I just am curious because Maybe I just kind of like bombarded the channel with too many 1v1s in one week. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I should have uh, spread them out a little bit more. But I don't know. Let me know down below what you guys think, man. I thought they were a great idea. And um, 
I really enjoy doing them. So maybe we got to get some bigger names up in here. Maybe we got to get our skill down and then um, try to 1v1 some. Maybe we should try to 1v1 Reaper Doc. Or I know he would destroy me, though. See that? And that's the, that's the bad part. It's like I know half the people I play are going to flat out destroy me, man. It's like it's insane, bro. It really is. Oof. So right now, when I went across the finish line, there should be the side-by-side -side of Reflex. Um, I'm not sure. I didn't even pay attention to the lap time that was on Reflex. I should have to see, but I will have to check that out when I'm editing. I'm curious as to how close the lap times are, man. I feel like they'd be really close. But I do also feel like I'm going way faster on this track, but I think that's just because the bikes are faster in MX bikes. So it does feel like it's spread out a little more. It's not as like compact. So being that that's the case, I feel like the lap times are probably pretty similar. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, Buzz, you did an amazing job on this, bro, for real. And um, oh, I hope to see more MX vs. ATV reflex tracks come along, man. And uh, yeah, dude, it's just awesome. So nostalgic, bro, for real, for real. Maybe we can get some of the outdoors uh, reflex tracks. I know we had, uh, who was it? I know Hearn released one, I think, back in the day. I feel like it was a while ago, but I feel like, I think Hearn did release, um, what was it called? I can't even think of the track right now, but I think Hearn did release one of the outdoors tracks that was in reflex. Um, or no, it was Racine. I think that was actually from Unleashed, not Reflex. But either way, man, those those tracks that they be having on MX vs. ATV Reflex or just any of the MX vs. ATV games are so creative, you know what I'm saying? And um, I love seeing them in the game, man. So the more of those we get in the game, the better. And psh, this is a blast. So I can't wait to get on there and race it. And Buzz, I hope to see some more work coming from you in the future on these, man. Uh, maybe you already have this track done. It, so you know how sometimes tracks get released and when they're released, they have like a groomed version and a rough version. Maybe you could go back and add some ruts and release a rough version of this track. Huh? Just saying? Nah. <laughs> I know that'd probably be a lot of work, but I also would really love that. I like the rougher style tracks recently, and I don't know why, but um, I thoroughly have been enjoying the rougher tracks. So it would be nice to see this have a little bit more ruts, but like I said, that's the only gripe that I have about this track at all. So, But yeah, man, that's Stone Point round one, and um, we did a side-by-side -side of the Reflex track in Reflex versus this. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see y'all next time, man. Peace.